These are the happy faces of the elderly who come to this Daughters of Charity of St. Vincent de Paul Center in Rome every Tuesday. They feel at home here because they have found a place to share with others. They say the center is their space, a space to pray, share meals, learn, and talk about their personal situations, but also to alleviate the common loneliness old age often brings. The sisters are very good to us, especially Sister Carla. She organizes things for us. We love her a lot. I love when she speaks. She talks about the church, the saints. She explains so many things to us. Think about it. I'm this old. She gives us advice and tells us to stick together. Sister Carla is the religious sister that assists them. The Italian decided to fully dedicate herself to serving society's most needy 47 years ago. We try to provide a beautiful service. We all do our best. We try to help everyone and resolve their problems. But there are many problems and needs, and we don't have the ability to resolve all of them. The important thing is we become their friends. We try to give them a calm and welcoming environment. Above all, a listening one. We listen to their needs. Each Tuesday, some 30 elderly enjoy this time the Daughters of Charity give them. Thus, initiatives like this one exemplify what Pope Francis asks for, for the elderly to be heard because they are the collective memory of communities. È brutto vedere gli anziani scartati. È cosa brutta, è peccato. As St. Vincent de Paul said, prayer is for the soul what food is for the body. These are two ingredients that are always present at this house's table. <laughs>